Hi, once again, uh, Nitin from Stencil. I am the founder director of Stencil. We are into innovative interior and exterior product and uh, we are based out of Bangalore. Well, I would say I was quite an accident into this business. Uh, I uh, come from marketing background in finance industry and it so happened that my brother-in-law introduced me to a friend of his in this industry and then uh, it all started from there. After that, there was no looking back and uh, today uh, I am uh, part of this industry from 20 years and uh, Stencil is about 10 years old company which has given a lot of innovative and unique products to the market. Well, I would not exactly term it as challenge. Uh, whenever we got a new product, a new concept into the market, introducing the product to the market, educating people about it and the application of the product was quite a difficult uh, thing for us. And uh, that's how uh, I think uh, we had a lot of learning curves in this and uh, after uh, successfully executing it and uh, standing out as a number one company in these products, I think that was the most fulfilling moment and uh, that's where I feel uh, you know it was a very unique journey for us. This is a very interesting question. Things have evolved uh, from where we started to today into a complete different uh, uh, gambit. Uh, when we started, it was more of a retail and a project setup where we used to physically go meet people. Today, if you see, it is more of an influencer market, Instagrams and social media has taken over the business. Having said that, still this industry uh, relies a lot upon touch and feel experience because anybody who's building a house or doing up his office is doing it once in a lifetime kind of situation. And there he wants to really choose the best for him. So that's where, uh, you know, the things have changed a lot, but at the same time, the connectivity of the client is still there. I think, um, you know, uh, long back somebody said, if you are not updated or if you are not uh, tech driven, you will be outdated or you'll be out of business. And uh, we see that coming true. Today, uh, starting from a basic CRM to a customer connect module, everything is uh, tech driven, tech uh, dependent. So we've also taken a lot of steps towards uh, taking this initiative to start our own apps, uh, getting into technology solutions with clients, making it more easier for them to reach out to our products, see them online and also uh, in e version of the products. So this makes their life easier. They save a lot of time and it's easy for them to adopt and see, you the, see the new product range. So that's the biggest advantage where we have adopted and you know are part of the industry now. I think starting uh, from this business, this business when we started uh, till now, I think we had a lot of these moments, especially some of those projects which we completed, which had uh, uh, won awards at various forums became our most uh, memorable moment for us. And one of the most successful part of this journey was consecutively being uh, the number one seller for uh, a particular product, uh, Fundamax to be precise, continuously six years in the market. That was the biggest uh, you know, uh, success for us and a wow moment for us. Other than that, yes, we have been uh, industry leaders in a lot of other products, uh, giving a lot of solution to the market. So the, uh, the satisfaction of a client appreciating us saying that, you know, these people uh, introduce very innovative and new product is a kick for us. Well, I think uh, this was a very base foundation of our, my company that, you know, whatever products we deal with will be a high quality product. The very reason we deal with high quality product is it is sustainable and it does not call for a lot of wastages and breakages and loss, right? When you do a low quality material, it has a repetitive requirement. It has a lot of uh, wastages in it. But the same thing when it is in a high quality product, then the longevity of the product is more, the usage of product is more, thereby it reduces the impact on environment. So this is a very important thing. I think any trader or any people in the business has to make sure just to save a little penny here and there. Don't compromise on the quality, ending up losing the entire value of the product. So honestly, when we started the business, it's only about career, right? We wanted to get set in our career. We wanted to do something. There was no uh, vision or a mission we had carved out. But over a period of time, we realized that, you know, uh, it is not only about doing business or making money, but also creating an impact in the society. And uh, this industry is one of the fastest growing industry. And our vision was to get most innovative and unique products into the industry, which are not heard of, which are not there in the market. And that we were fairly successful in getting a lot of products first time in India. And not only that, now our vision is uh, to grow the business to international standards and uh, uh, grow across uh, the borders. I think my uh, biggest learning uh, throughout my career was success is not very difficult to achieve, but after being successful, working hard is more important. Being there is more critical. It is very, uh, you know, it takes a lot of effort to become successful, but to continue to be successful requires equally or more, uh, you know, work, hard work. So, Suggestion to the young entrepreneurs is focus on your goal and give your best.